Greetings there, everyone. Well, I trust you're having a nice day today. In any case, I uh, have an interesting installment for you, uh, another installment in the cooking series. And so, you know, it's nice to have uh, an everything bagel and have it toasted. Well, you can just do that on this fish, uh, you know, grill. Just put the, just take them open and put it straight onto the grill and give it a nice little toast. Afterwards, you can put on nice, uh, you know, some uh, peanut butter and jam. Really nice. But also, you know, it's kind of nice to have a quick, simple snack lunch for two. And so the easy way to do it is you can just take one of these sidekicks, throw it into this container with some water, and cook it quickly. Get it, make sure the water is boiled, and then it cooks real fast. It's not difficult at all. Give it a nice stir. This particular cook set, okay, a compact cook set from the Stanley, you know, it comes with a spoon slash fork slash something else. <laughs> and it even has a way to be carried. So it's kind of convenient. But in any case, you can put it right in there. And this particular compact cook set also comes with this. So you can cook that and then put it into there. Or you can, uh, you know, put it on a plate that comes with this set. So that's just my suggestions. Okay. And it's uh, really nice and convenient. And should you then just want to leave it warmed, you can just put the lid on. Kind of convenient. Okay, so uh, that's my other nice little suggestions. And uh, as you can see, that's how it puts it back together. Everything was put right inside and then folded up. And then you just take the lid and put it back. Easy to carry. Okay, and uh, just remember that a fishing knife can be used for more than fishing. You can use it to cut the uh, everything bagel down the middle, but you can also use it to spread the peanut butter. And uh, it's quite convenient that way. And remember to leave the plastic bag and keep it, because then this way you can put everything back into there when you're not using it after you've cleaned it. You know, you come home from your camping trip, you can put everything back into its proper containers and put it back into its box. And then that way it stays as clean as possible. Okay. Now the other thing about uh, fishing line is that uh, 40 pound test fishing line can be used for more than just fishing. Okay. In an emergency, you can help put up your uh, tarp. And in an emergency, well, you can use it for a variety of other purposes as well. So it's nice to have 40 pound test uh, fishing line uh, because, like I said, it can be used for more than just fishing. And a lot of emergency uses it's uh, very useful for. And as you can see, this uh, fishing grill is very versatile. Yes, you can put fish on it. it tastes delicious. <laughs> you just gut the fish and then take off its head. And then leave it with the skins and you know skins on it, you know the skin and scales on it, and just give it a nice grill. When the fish is nice and soft, tender, you know, then you know it's cooked. And then you just fillet off the uh, the the fins and scales, and what you got left is just nice meat inside. Okay, and uh, you know a nice fish inside, you know. And remember, uh, when you are uh, going camping, whoever the driver is, slip them some money. Gas isn't cheap anymore. Okay, so it's kind of nice to give them a little, uh, you know, help for the uh, travel. And so uh, please uh, like and uh, subscribe to this channel, but also hit the community, uh, pay, you know, go to the community page and the about page, please. And also share my videos and even share my channel. And please comment. I really appreciate your comments. You have a really great day. Thank you very much. Bye.